YouTubers. Today we'll be playing Skylander Spiral's Adventure and we're going to be doing the first few, like, I think the first three levels. And we're going to be showing you our two air characters because each, me and Ryan have one of each element. So here, this is the one I'll be using. Lightning Rod. And this is the one I will be using. Yeah, I have all the dragons in the first game, so I have rolling for here. Okay, so first we'll just go to the area where we get to put our levels here. Um, We're gonna skip that one because that one's kind of boring, boring and dumb. Okay, okay so pair with pastures. Okay, and I guess we'll just show you what it does. Okay, no, I'll just get that. And also, um, for Roland's wait, well, yeah, wrong button. For Roland's path, I chose the um, the the Tempest Cloud path, which is I think it's pretty good. The clouds do a lot of damage. And for Lightning Rod, it's on the um, the giant lightning bolt path. <laughs> the giant. Yeah, I like that path. It makes him look gigantic when he does it. He's even bigger than a giant actually in the Giants games. Yeah, it does pretty good damage on the young bad guys. It also can make things too quick like that. And we're not going to go into any of the elemental zones. We might do another video with, with like a walkthrough. Yeah. But for right now we're just going to show you mostly what the characters do. And the basics mm -hmm. of the game. So, to like get past some walkways you would have to like push big objects like that. Which is, would be hard for one to push unless you're a giant. But they don't have guys in this game. Oh okay, yeah, some characters, as you can see, world runs a lot faster than um, lightning run. Okay, easy enemy here. And um, you get three attacks for each player. Except like I got the um, I got this attack where I can just destroy enemies like that. I got a lightning bolt and I got a cloud that can stick around me. And um, do you want to explain your top? Uh, yeah, I have um. Anyway, okay. I have this rainbow thingy. It actually doesn't do very bad damage. But oh yeah, and I can also heal other people with it. You get the soul gem. I have black ability. And this is the path I chose. You get three of these gigantic things. To make a giant rainbow explosion. And that can damage like multiple like five enemies at one time. Skymasters of the magic stronger in this So sometimes it leaves an annoying electrocuting sound. Don't know how to get rid of it. Oh yeah, and this thing right here, it actually makes more enemies and they are called chompies and uh, they call it a chompy pod. It's pretty basic. Pretty easy. And then also there's some super areas like um like you would have to push this um to get and there's like sometimes there's secret areas like where there's money over there. And then Usually in the secret area, there's a lot more bad guys than that. I mean, each of these clouds does 30 damage, which is quite a bit. <laughs> I forgot how much um, my lightning goes. Your lightning, the, the big lightning strike does 26. Oh yeah, funny. I forgot. And also, if you see on the bottom left or the bottom right, um, you could level up your people. Like, right now they're both on level 10, which I think is the full amount on level. Yeah, for Sprouse Adventure, it's full amount of leveling up. Oh, and there's also some long distance attackers, which I think would be like lightning rod, and there's uh, I mean lightning rod, and there's some ones that like don't attack long distance, which would be um, stump smash. Yeah, stump smash is very. Oh, no, actually, stump smash does have a few um, long distance attacks as acorns, but they're not as useful as these fists. Yeah. I don't know if there's any characters that are actually completely. Um, single distance. I think all of them have at least one long distance attacker. I'm not sure. What? I'm trying to think of one. Oh, what? Warp? Hmm. Maybe Igniter? Wait, no. No, Igniter has a long sword. Yeah. That has long distances. Like that area that we just went into, that was a secret area. But we'll show you the secret, like some of the other secret areas in like the world. Um, let's play them. Oh yeah, she's been captured by a bunch of evil drugs. We gotta save her so she can get on with more important things. Like thank you. Boom. Yeah, once. 
once you get all the upgrades for each of the characters, most of the first levels are really easy. Yeah. <laughs> but when you first start playing, um, the first levels are still pretty easy, but you should get at least like 10 Skylanders to um, beat like the last level because it's really hard. Yeah, like chaos. Oh yeah, and they also send like some mini games, like you have to shoot different locks like this. And how many um, Skylanders do you have in total, Adam? Like, total, including all the swap force and seven. giants, we have a, um, 39. Yeah. Yeah, later That's we're going to... We haven't completed the swap force game yet, though. Oh well, yeah, um, this hit right here. There is a, supposed to be like a legendary treasure there. Yeah. And um, we'll definitely show you how to get to that one. That one's, that one's really, really hard really to figure hard. out. Yeah. But that's going to be in a later video. Yeah. Yeah, should we skip this? Um, yeah, let's just show them like the different people. Like, these are the good guys. Yeah. Callie and Flynn are the good people. Because they're kind of annoying. <laughs> That's me at your service. Charming. Yes, yes, I know. Must be pretty overwhelming for you to finally be the best pilot in all of Skylands. You know, I didn't need any help back there. I had them right where I wanted them. Sure you did. Hmm. Whatever. <laughs> well, yes, ma'am. You are welcome. So yeah. that's the first level. And we have three stars on all of them, except for one, one glitch level. It's like glitched on ours. It never gives us the enemy goal, no matter what we do. Yeah. So here's the next one in the air, like section of the game. Are we gonna show them two different more challenges? Yeah. No. Alright. For this for the first like air levels, we're gonna do the air people. Alright. The next video I think is water, so I'll show you our two water people. Now the levels are going to get... Oh, yeah, and also, just for, like, a reminder, and when you always start the level, you should always go back a few, because, like, you start the level right here, and there's usually, like, a legendary um, treasure, like, right back here. Yeah, because how many people look up? And they're going yeah, they backwards. Going. Yeah. And it's good to get money, because if you get money, you can uh, upgrade your people. Like, right now, they're all fully upgraded. Oh, yeah, if you just saw that fairy person... You unlock um, the money you will get the fairy, you could actually start doing the upgrades. You unlock her in this one. And if you have um either Spiral's Advent I mean if you have the uh, Skylanders Giants or um Swap Force, you should probably get this game too, because it's um it's actually, I think, one of the best versions of the game. Yeah, because the levels aren't as long as in the Giants and Swap Force, because in the Swap Force levels, the levels take at least like 40 minutes each. Yeah. Doing it really quickly. And these levels are short and sweet, kind of. Yeah, they're funner too. And the storyline is better. Oh, yeah, and then I saw like bigger mini games like this, we have to shoot down the, um. Uh, yeah, it's also good to get, um. Because these, the red pearls, they give you money. I don't I think I'm the yellow one. Yeah, 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 I'm the yellow one. Oh. Oh, I missed it. I wonder, if, is, is it possible to shoot the dragon? If it is, can you, like, put it in the comments, please? Because that would be really, I don't think you can, though, but it would be neat if you could. <laughs> yeah, we always try to. Even though we have no really need for money right now. <laughs> yeah. Except for buying stuff in the giant store. Now, yeah, the money carries over from each of the characters in this game you get. Yeah. Oh yeah, and just to let you know, the the portal for the software works on the um their first game of Shadow right? And Giants too. Yeah. So, see how we collected all those red, um, gems? We get a lot more money at the end. And also the cheese and cake and stuff, it gives you, like... And if you have the Dark Light Crypt Adventure Pack, then it unlocks high also, which is kind of, kind of rare, but you can get it in the game sometimes, I think. Yeah.
Yeah, all the characters are pretty powerful once you level them up, except for some. Hey, yeah, I like Eruptor. Eruptor. It, if you have um, Giants or Swap Force, Eruptor is really, really good because they changed his stats a bit. I'm not good at all. A lot, actually, especially in Swap Force. But in this first game, he's kind of stinkish. Yeah. And you'll see once we get to the fire levels. <laughs> okay. I just know, if I were to shoot these things down, why can't we just shoot them all in the past? Hey, yeah. And some of the sh uh, some of the ships, ships. Take more ships and they can shoot at you. Yeah, and now I do. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So it's kind of funny if you have a giant, because like a gi two giants aren't supposed to be able to fit in there, but they can. Yeah. Except you can't play as giants in the first game. Yeah. It would be really neat if you could, though. Face my awesome lightning power. Have we lost any health? I don't know if we have. Yeah, we I have. I don't have to. The Tempest Fogs are really strong in here. So is that the Oh yeah, yeah this thing cool. I just attacked, that wizard thing right here. Um, they could uh, make, they could heal other enemies that are attacking you, but they don't really do anything. Yeah, the Spell Punks you. are kind See, of... The theory I'm there's a different about. Spell Punk, I think, for each I of know, the games. I mean, the levels. So much fun, but the Skylanders are back. My fairies always dance with the Skylanders. I am Persephone. Okay. Um. Oh yeah. Um. When we were attacking those enemies, there was a gate, and you have to destroy all the enemies before the gate will open. Yeah, I don't need that. And also the flying power, it doesn't. But there actually, it doesn't just make you go faster. It also can let you travel over water. Yeah. And. It gives you actually a bit more health. I mean, no, not health. It gives you a larger chance of being able to deflect a hit. Well, and I think these two are really powerful, but I've also heard for the air element that um, Sonic Boom is really good. We've never really tried her before, though, because we only got two of each element. Yeah. But as far as I know, um, I think of the air element. I've never really tried Wolf Warnado, but he doesn't seem like he's the best of the air element. I think he's kind of the worst, even though he's pretty good. So that's just a guess, though. Yeah. And it also, because there's different paths for each Skylander, makes it kind of hard to decide which is the best. Oh, yeah, and these little mini games that we're doing, um, the, the, the mini games change it other at like other. Like, what's that called? Like, different places. Like, right now in the, um, like, the air area. And oh, but in Dark Light Creek, there's, like, uh, yeah, there's, like, different things. that one in 7 minutes and 40 minutes, I think. Yeah, the levels are a lot shorter in here than in Swap Force. Yeah. Like, okay, oh, and for the last level... This is the boss for the air. I want to click the beat button and I want to show something. And also, see this little kid right here? You have a cloudy butt! <laughs> he, he says different things for each one. Like yeah. Now you go. One that shoots rainbows? Neato! Where can I get one of those? Oh yeah, we should show those for each of the characters we have, because that's kind of funny. Yeah. Ah, oh, strong funny. Okay, and this is the boss for 
air section where you find the um, eternal air element. And these are, I think, each of these ones are the finest of the game, the boss levels. Not to me, this one's actually not that fun. Actually, it yeah. kind of is, but it's like old some old Rodan has found the eternal air once, but they guess now they're trying to harness its power. I guess. I think the earth. I kind of like the earth. In this game, I really like the earth areas because yeah, the, the earth levels are um the earth levels are fun to me, and also the characters are ridiculously yeah. overpowered. Yeah. And we just have Bash and Dino Ring and t oh yeah, and for we also had the Adventure. not including the two we have. We also did Adventure Packs, like I said. Yeah, so we have Dino Ring, Bash, and Terrafin. They're all overpowered. Yeah. And I played with um, Prison Break at a friend's house before he's also overpowered. Yeah. Oh yeah, that thing does 17 damage and also does like 3 damage afterwards, like the lightning bolt can hook on. Yeah, do you know what thing is my giant thing does? I think it does 26, but oh, it yeah, does Oh yeah, these things, they don't like good damage, but they push you aside. They're just annoying. Yeah. I can fly. Oh, this thing is 26 damage, and my fault is 36. And also there's... A, and also there's elemental power, which means in sections of the game, there's certain elements that have like more strength. a sign on the top left, if there was, it would say like... Yeah, like... Oh, yeah, like right there. Like the magic... The magic element, except we are just going to stay with the AR. Yeah. I'll show you the magic and the Arcan bolts and stuff. You don't spare us. Uh -huh. Man, that does 18 damage. Yeah. I think the, uh, my giant form thing, I think that does the most damage. Yeah, it does. But my lightning pot is just to get money out there. The okay. other path for um, lightning rod is really, really weird. It like makes three clouds fall around him that shock other people if you get close. Yeah, I wouldn't recommend getting that one. I would get the giant thing. Because that looks just awesome. <laughs> and for um, Whirlwind, the other path is the... The rainbow or doom path, and it makes it so there's two rainbows that you're out instead of one. They do, I think, 26 damage each. Oh. Oh, and oh, yeah, there's also if you hold it down, it makes a rainbow of doom, which it looks cool, but it's not as powerful as like the Tempest Pods are. And also, that chain reaction is really neat. <laughs> Oh yeah, and also the enemies, the further along they get a lot more powerful than these guys. Ow. Oh, oh yeah, and also there's enemies in like the barrels and stuff. Sometimes. Especially Chompy. You really needed that giant lightning bolt for Chompy. Yes, that's something. Oh yeah, and also I can't, we're not going to really show this, I think, but um, for the one of the last levels, the Arcane area, those Arcane Automatons, I figured out that Whirlwind is really, really good at destroying those on this Tempest Cloud path. Oh, and also these things right here, if you bump into those ones, well, they say it's full enough to you, you die. We're not well, completely you lose 5 health. Bam, I'm so devastated I lost 5 health. <laughs> So now you have to go into the castle and destroy the stuff in there. I'm bat thingy. Turn off air element. Yeah. I 
Oh, how do we get down there again? Go the other way. Just go all the way. Oh, no. Right here. <laughs> but, hey, but I, I thought you had to go all the way back. If we did, I would have to change. You only see these things in this level. I, I think there's only like one of them or something. Yeah, this one has one more. There's more. There. I guess that would be much. Shoot, I mean, I don't know. Oh, I actually lost a lot of health from that thing. Or you something else, I don't know. And I've also been healing you the entire time. <laughs> oh yeah, and also people on high things are just, Yeah. Um, they can be killed by like, mortar attacks and in the air attacks. Both yeah. of us have Like those. some people like um, Gilgren, I think. Yeah, he can't attack those people once he's too no. That's the only thing, that's one of the only things the Rucker's good at. Yeah, he's good at And you don't really need to get any extra characters to do that because Trigger Happy can do that. Yeah. Because it has to barrel. I think in this level the most annoying things are those wizards. You mean the live throws? Yeah, or I guess. No, no, the wizards oh. are those by Teddy. Oh, the witches. The witches. The, those other witch throws or something. I don't know exactly what they're called. <laughs> oh, alright. Oh, we got it. Each one had the worst time. Wait, we're being timed on this? Oh no. No, you're running into the people in front of you while they're coming down and spike. Oh yeah, this time thing that's in the top left? That's for something else. I'll attack this guy. And I got these throws over here. You can't stop me. Yeah, that's gonna just be like a lot of ones now. Now, where's boss? That looks awesome. <laughs> it, um, this thing, it only shows the player one doing it. You know, player two goes in first. Okay. So that's the air element. And next we're going to be doing the water element. Yeah. So please like, favorite, and subscribe. And please go watch some of our other videos. Bye.